The seventh. You're taking off, huh? Yep. <laughs> Don't go cutting loose just because I'm not there to keep an eye on you. You're not around like most of the time, Sojiro. I'll look after Futaba and the cat while you're gone. You owe me one. Look at Magana just not looking at me. We'll talk more about our next job once we get back. Can't wait. Good. He's so fucking ugh. Good. He's so upset. He's just pissed off at Fudaba. I'm so sleepy. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a really quick episode. <laughs> it's evening already. It'll take over six hours to get there, so why not sleep on the plane? Wait, have we been in the fucking airport all day waiting to get on a plane? What the fuck? I'll do that. Oh, it's almost time to check in. Oh, also, it's really weird how time works here because technically we're leaving the evening of today. We're leaving the evening, but we're going to show up on the morning of the 7th because they're 19 hours behind. Yeah, like we're, we're going to be showing up in the morning of the 7th. So actually, maybe it'll be a long episode because technically two days. <sighs> Looks like it's going to take off on time. Nice. I feel like a lot of flights headed to America tend to run late or get canceled. Wow. Atlas shitting on America. Is it just me or is Ryuji not here yet? Ah. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to make a mad dash like this. Uh, coming late even on a day like this? That's all you're bringing. Well, it's only four nights, right? Ain't it enough? You're underpacked. Really? You guys are just freaking out over this. Well, I guess it's better than bringing too many useless things. I mean, I guess you could fit. I bet you could. We haven't even looked in the bag. I bet you could fit four nights worth of stuff in there. You could. Four nights worth of clothes. We're not bringing food. Underwear, obviously. You, Ryuji, you better have four pairs of underwear in there, because I swear to God, if you do not change underwear every day, you are the grossest human being on the face of the planet. Hey guys, they want us to gather near the boarding gate soon. And if you go, and if you can really help it, if you can't help it, then it's fine. Like if you're camping or something, but if you go more than a day without showering, you're gross as well. Just saying. Well, here's what I do for my routine for that stuff. I shower, then a day I won't, I'll go without showering, then I'll shower again. But unless I, like, do something fairly active outside, if I even sweat, like, a little bit, I'm showering. Like, so every day after work, when I was working landscaping or construction, shower. Shower after work, because I was in dirt all day. But if I'm, like, if I, like, chill inside all day and don't do anything, then I probably won't shower. I'll shower the next day. Why don't we take a group shot before we take off? So Ryuji, don't be gross. Oof, sounds good. You be our cameraman, okay? Let me join in too. You too, Makoto. <laughs> Alright. I think Makoto, our like supervisor, is gonna get called out for being friends with us at this point. Here it goes. Supposed to look? Let me see. Let me see. Ah, that's adorable. Ryuji, you got crap in your eyes. What? Holy shit, she's right. How could you tell, Futaba? You surprised? I stuck an app on Soviet's phone. I could see all I want through his camera. You're looking right now. You're looking now, right, Soviet? Man, you can't underestimate the original Medjed. That's scary. And Joker, who like <laughs> is just sweating right now. Like, wait, you can see ev everything? Yes. You you can see everything? Yes. Futaba's was like, why the fuck did you watch Les Miserables like three fucking times in the last week? Because <laughs> it gets my kindness of Futaba. Shut up. <laughs> I'm so glad she's not an enemy of ours. That's scary, ain't it? 